Hard hit by McDavid, short side, and he couldn't bank it off Demko. Hughes gives it up. Ronick needs a clear. Redirected to Hughes. He's going to skate it out. We're going to have a fight. Hyman, and Hyman, and Hyman and to JT Miller. A couple of chopping right hands from JT Miller as Hyman never got balanced to unload a right of his own. And Giuseppe roughing up McDavid here again now as well as McLeod comes in. This all started with Miller and McDavid, and they went at a couple good, vicious cross checks from both of them. Was there a I penalty mean, called I mean, there on Mil Di Giuseppe? I'm not sure. Maybe on McDavid in the corner, but right from the, the defensive zone, JT Miller with the assignment of McDavid literally followed him around the ice as he should, and then they got into it in front of the net. Is there an extra two on Vancouver here? I'm not sure. I did not see an arm go up during that battle initially. Hyman came in, though, and I think Hyman's going to get the initial penalty because he came in on Miller. Watch this. So they come in. Boom. That pop right there by Miller doesn't like it. There's one cross check. They keep going at it. And then Hyman comes in right here and gives him one from behind. I believe that's where the initial one was. And then McDavid again with Di Giuseppe here just going after it. I mean, I don't like the fact that it took everybody a little longer to get in there with McDavid getting roughed up by Di Giuseppe. But finally, McLeod gets in there and... A little wake-up check here for Edmonton. When there's a scrum, everybody should have been on deck there. Nickholm sprinting back. Pedersen to the net. Dishes off. Rich shot. Same. Skinner came way out to challenge. And then got belted by McDavid. And they're going to call the Edmonton captain. Yeah, that was the scrum. initial penalty. Oh, I mean, this is just getting a little gnarly on the ice. And call it frustration, call it whatever you want. Well, and this is a sign that the Oilers finally have had enough. And yeah. I'm sure a lot of people in Edmonton are thinking it's about time. And I think it's Connor, too. You're seeing some frustration come out in him. He just gave the stinky glove to Hughes on that shift, and he's just fed up with. You know how this season has been going. I mean, this is a good internal compass for him as well. When you're not playing your best and you're not going, I mean, he just ran in the suitor here, but obviously took him down in the process with the cross check, and then he comes right back into the scrum, goes after Hughes a bit here. We'll settle things. Oh, they might have whistled sorted. Leon for a ten here.